Those against the death penalty in Nebraska are hoping to sway some opinions this holiday weekend. And today they launched a new ad urging people not to sign the death penalty petition. Joe Chioto joins us live with more on what those ads are saying and if they'll work. John and Mallory declined to sign is in retaliation to petitions circulating to overturn what the legislature did and keep capital punishment in Nebraska. But the signatures have been circulating for weeks and this ad right here was just launched today. Um, it's pretty clear from what they're trying to do right now that, that they want to deny uh, Nebraskans a chance to vote on, on this. Rod Edwards says he believes the Nebraska legislature acted too fast in repealing the death penalty. He's the field director of Nebraskans for the death penalty, working to collect enough signatures by the end of August. But will this ad here be a roadblock? If someone wants your signature to bring back a failed system, say no. For me, it's about living my faith. It's not a political issue. We need a smarter alternative. I'm not signing anything. Decline to sign. Stacey Anderson with Nebraskans for an alternative to the death penalty says this will help catch people's attention as they travel this weekend. Uh, as they're coming across petition circulators uh, over the weekend, they can consider why they should declined to sign that petition. She says the legislature made the right call and it should stay that way. They studied the issue very carefully. They came to the conclusion that Nebraskans are better off without the death penalty and that we could move on and spend this money on much more important things. Edward says he doesn't believe these ads will work. He says the amount of signatures he's received is above what he anticipated. People are seeking us out. People want to sign this petition. They want to have a say in this matter. And now we can take a look at this. The signatures, of course, that many people are signing will be collected until the end of August. The amount will determine whether or not the death penalty will make it to the 2016 ballot. Now, Edwards, who you saw in the video, tells me they are expecting to spend about $1.5 million on that petitioning.